Hey guys. <clears throat> now, for those of you who know, I am a Star Wars fan. I've got all the movies. Uh, episode 7 came out earlier this week. Alright, you can see The Force Awakens in that list. That's all seven films. Fantastic film, by the way. For those of you who haven't seen it, definitely give it a watch. So... I want to give my thoughts on the lightsaber duels in the films. Starting with A New Hope, because that's where it all started. Now, the, 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 the lightsaber duel between Obi-Wan and Darth Vader, it's just very basic. I mean, I had Alec Guinness who played Obi-Wan in that film. At that point, the guy was already, I believe he was already in his 60s, so... He had very limited movement, so it was just, it was just like a very basic, like, like sort, sort of fight. Just like that, that, that. Uh, uh. So it's very basic. And um, <clears throat> so in episode five, they brought in some choreography for Luke versus Vader. I'm, I'm guessing it's just the best they could do, best they could do at the time. S still a very entertaining fight. And then they did the same thing for episode six. Limited choreography, but still um, a good duel. Not the best, but still one I like to watch. But then when we get into episode one, now they have tons of choreography, loads of choreography, and like in episode one we have like. Uh, Darth Maul versus Qui Gon, Obi Wan. The, 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 how the three of them just flow with their light, with their lightsabers. Just, it's just, it's a beautiful thing to watch. Very beautiful. But people have criticised it for like, like for being like a dance and how choreographed um, it is. But what they do have to remember on how how long these guys have to practice, train to 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 do them. Like, because if you watch the behind the scenes for episode three, you'll see Ewan McGregor, who plays Obi-Wan, Hayden Christensen, who plays Anakin, practice again and again and again and again to get it right. And even if they don't miss a step with their, with their practice, they will do it all over again just to make sure they, just to make sure they have it nailed down. And it does annoy me that people criticise it now for being like dancing. They, because when it comes to the prequels, anyone will just find anything just a bad mouth. Even something that's just absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Ticks me off. Episode 2, I want to say the lightsaber duels um, was, was all that great. Because, you know, with Obi-Wan, Anakin versus Count Dooku, it's very short. Not really that spectacular. And then we had Count Dooku versus Yoda. That, that, that was fun to watch. You had um, Christopher Lee, who plays Count Dooku. You, in some shots, you can definitely set, see that it's someone in makeup and you know to look like him because um the late great christopher lee um was already in his 70s at that point so from what you watch in this fight with um in the film you can definitely tell it's not him as i said the guy's in his 70s um and then in episode three the lightsaber fight that everyone was waiting for, especially me. Obi Wan versus Anakin. <sighs> but even this, even this fight has, has come under um, criticism, not just for being like a dance, but on how and what on how long it takes. They say oh, it goes on for too long, but there's a reason why it goes on for so long. It's Obi Wan and Anakin. Obi-Wan trained Anakin. They know each other so well. They know each other's moves. 
Anakin's more powerful, Obi-Wan's more experienced. So, yeah, it's going to test... So if, you, so, if you've been with someone who you trained, or not just trained, or, or you've just been with for a long time, then all of a sudden they're your enemy, and you're going to be in a fight, it's going to take a long time. It will be a long fight, because you know each other that well. It's going to take a long time. So... There you go. I mean, and I, my thoughts on the lightsaber jewels, they are fantastic. They are emotional. They are emotional because of the characters. And it's just, it's just fun to watch. I mean, like, if you don't want to, if, like, if you want to watch the fights, but you don't want to watch the movie just to see the fights, yeah, go on, yeah, go on YouTube and then, you know, type out, say, Obi-Wan versus Anakin. And and you will see their fight, like without without Palpatine and Yoda's like say saber duel at the same get you know getting cut in between them. So yeah, you know if you just want to watch the fights, yeah, go on YouTube and yeah you know, and yeah you know, just watch the lightsaber fights and just watch and see how entertaining them um, those fights can be, and just have a good time. Just enjoy what these people put hours. Upon hours upon hours of training for our entertainment. So that's my thoughts on lightsaber duels. And uh, so I hope you guys ha have a fantastic day. Take care of yourself. <laughs>